Hey, it's Jeremy from Retro Shop here. Just wanted to show a quick tutorial on how to change out the stock fog lights here to the Morimoto XB Ram fog lights. So really not a whole lot to this, especially if you've got the non-sport bumper. Unfortunately, the guys with the sport bumpers, you're going to have to pull the bumper to do this. This is for the 09 through 12 models or the 10 and up heavy duties. So what do you need? You need a 10 millimeter socket and, well, just get on your back and have some fun. Okay, so we're under the truck now and I've already disconnected the stock halogen bulb here from the stock connector. So what's next? Really not a whole lot to it. You've got three bolts here. Got one here, one here, and one here. Those need to be removed with a, it's a 10 millimeter socket. So you pull those out and we'll get on to the next part here shortly. Okay, so next up we are going to remove the fog light here from the stock bracket here. So you've got three mounts here and you'll notice on each of them they just have a little clip. You push that in and then you push in the next one here. Make sure you get the bottom one first and it pops out. That one's being a little booger. Okay, so bracket, fog light. And of course you'll have two of these, we're just doing the one side here for now. Now, next, these parts here, little ball and socket type things, have to be popped off. So, we're going to do that. We've got a little tool here. We got these from Harbor Freight, I guess it was. And makes it really easy to pop these things right off. bottom one, it just spins. You need this whole mechanism right here. So we got to pull this all the way out. The adjuster here. Then you can just pinch this and pull this out. So that whole piece comes out. Here's your fog light, which, you know, whatever. You set that aside now. So, we are going to replace that with the Morimoto XB LED fog lights here. So, when we open these up, you'll have two little plugs here, and we'll get to where those go in a second. And we have fog lights in these bags here. So here's what we have. This is an ABS molded piece of plastic here that goes over an LED fog light. You'll see that there's, you know, all black housing here. And, you know, no lens across this. It's not needed. You know, this is just basically a bezel here that goes over this fog light. So on the back, you're going to see that you have a couple wires here. So you've got your black and red. That's what these are for right here. And when you go out to the truck, you know, the best way to do it is you'll have these things pulled off and you'll go to set these in. You just want to make sure you route the black wires to the black wires. So we'll get to that whenever we go out to the truck. So again, we've got the same mounting points on the back of this fog light. You've got your little ball here, ball here, and the opening down here for this adjuster. So looks just like the stock fog light here. So you take your little connector or your little uh, 
ball and socket deals here and just pop them on. And this one here, set that piece back in and put your adjuster in. This will still be the adjusting mechanism for when these are in the truck itself. So you've got your little white wheel here that when it's in the truck you can get underneath it and move it up and down. So same setup. Okay, so what's next is you take this and you're going to mount that back in your bracket here. So it just pops in place here. And I like to get it partially on, you know, the first step and then go to the second step on these little clips because they're a little bit tricky to line up sometimes. Alright, that one's on, that one's on, and that one's on. Just give it a quick pull just to make sure it's fully seated. Then we take this and our sockets here, and we go back out to the truck. Okay, time to reinstall. So, those little plugs I was talking about, they go to here. You just line up your black wire to the black wire, and then you can plug that in. So when it comes to mounting this, it does take a little bit of finagling to get back into the bumper here. Best way, kind of set it up, Move this across and set it back in. Then you've got your three bolts to set back in and you're done. And here we have the completed product. Fog light is in. Gives a great look with the black bezel against the black bezel here in the bumper. So if you guys have any questions about this, just let me know. Jeremy at RetroShop.us